All right, welcome back to Sycamore. When we last left off, we failed a keep quest again. And I am sitting on the opposite banks of the main river here. And we'll call it the Sycamore River. And uh, I'm looking at uh, a town that just keeps growing and growing. And I tell you what, if you haven't seen their Discord lately or watched their Twitter feed, and by, by they I mean Polymorph Games, the Foundation people, they just showed a short video of the new Lord Manor that's going to be coming up as soon as the winter patch releases, and it looks quite good. Really excited for that, and uh, we won't we won't see it here in the preview. The preview I think is pretty much done um, as far as features go, but we'll definitely see it once the uh, patch finally gets released. Anyway, let's uh, turn on the user interface. It should come as no surprise that I haven't opened anything, and so let's get this over here. And let's uh, bring up our villager list. How many unemployed do I have? I have a number of unemployed. And so this time out, what I want to do is I'm going to build a keep up here. Uh, they're very paranoid because uh, we've lost a good number of people. And so I can't get a good view up here because this hill's so tall. So I'll come up on top of the hill. And then there, now I get a good view. Yes, yeah, so we're going to put a keep way up here. Uh, and probably ladders up to it, just because I've never done that before. The fisher huts are getting complete, so I need to assign some more jobs so we have some more fish. And then, I don't know, maybe a, th maybe a fourth keep. So that would be the third keep. There's actually two here. That would be a third. I'm thinking maybe a fourth keep. Or maybe just another independent tower here with another group of soldiers and another group of dummies. And by dummies, I don't mean soldiers, but the actual uh, dummies that they beat on. Uh, I think I'm going to do that. I think I'm going to do that first. The first thing I'm going to do is just a quick, very quick, oh, that's right. We have to, we have to assign soldiers. All right, let's do this in order. Let's do this in order. First off, let's, let's find some nearby people that can be fishermen. And Thudabald, all right, Thudabald, where do you live? You uh, do not have a home. No, you have a home. And you're actually over here. I think that's fine. Does everybody have a home? How about Cinetig? There's a name for you. You're over here in the farming area. Oh yeah, remember we were gonna do bread farming, right? And Avalon, you're over here. Um, yeah, you're over here on this side. So Avalon, you're on this side. And Mythig, you're on the bread side, aren't you? Yep. And we're kind of all over the place. Josiah. You're also on the bread side. All right, we've, we've looked enough. There should be a notable difference in distance when I find these people. So let's go all the way to the end. That's Mila. You've already been assigned. You are going to be Thudabald. Do some fishing. And you, if there's one close enough, is going to be Avalon. Yes, at 138. There you go. And uh, let's, let me double check. I believe Avalon, you were over here. Ye no, that's wrong. Uh, that's Avelina. Wait a minute. Was there another Avelin? Right, that's Avelina. Not to be confused with Avelin, right? Uh, yeah, Avelin with a Y. <laughs> I gotta click on you here to see you. And yes, you live over here. Everything's fine. It's all fine. It's all good. Okay, now, with those jobs all assigned, the increased fishermen, and... We've got these warehouses all assigned, even though they're overflowing, absolutely overflowing with stock. Uh, these markets, did we ever assign anybody to these markets? We did not. We set this one to be bread, but we didn't assign anybody to it. We set this one to be fish, and uh, yes, we're selling fish here. And we set this one right. Wow, I actually finished my job. I'm going to have to check on the job list to see but next step I want to assign this, the missing soldiers because we've got to get them training so let's go ahead and just randomly assign a bunch of people until we have all our soldiers back and then that was that one and then for this one um, that's a whole lot of missing soldiers and Immigration is in seven days. I missed the uh, if we had any more coming in, but we don't have any anybody anybody unemployed right now. And I just took from our potential. I want to say breadwinners. That's not what I mean, but yeah, 
from the from the bread area here. And we do have farmers here, but we have yet to get a growing season. And we don't have... Okay, now they're sowing. So as soon as they show up to work, they should sow. But that would require them to show up for work. So just as soon as they show up for work. By the way, so I don't forget later. This looks like an ideal place for berries once we actually run low. We have 1,600... 49 berries, 847 fish. Let's speed the game up. And right, I'm going to put a keep over here. We need to bring more people in, which shouldn't be a problem. So how high should I put the keep? So we have iron here and iron here. I've got two iron mines. And we've got iron up here. And then should I just go ahead and put the keep way up on top here? Right? And maybe I should build the ladders first. Wow, I'm on the wrong side of the mountain. Let's build the ladders first. This is always tricky, but it's under monuments, and it is the Great Ladder. And we will want to put... Kind of kind of put them in line here, but... Right, so how do we go? There we go. Suddenly that doesn't look like a ladder. That looks like a ramp. This is Great Ladder for a Cliff. Great Ladder, uh-oh. Well, that's strange. I didn't update it. Oh, you know what? I just drew it wrong. This is what happens when you draw it backwards. But that's interesting, isn't it? <laughs> that looked quite interesting. Okay, let's put that down. Now we see that it's, it's red on one side. Uh, so we could do a ramp as well. And let's get it right about here. What are we doing? So that sort of works. They're going to be they're going to be climbing through the trees yet you know yet I like the way I actually like the way that looks and we don't have any red in there. And so that gets you up to here. So let's go ahead and start and then let's build the final ladder up to here. And uh, we'll do that right now and go back to monuments and do the great ladder and we'll put this here. There we go. And something like this. Right up the hill. Might want to scoot this back a little bit. Uh, no, I screwed up. There, something like this. Now, you're flashing red, so that's not going to work. That will work. Okay. It's not perfect, but it works. And right, you can climb right up. Get on top of the hill, and then we'll build our keep. So there's start construction. And then we'll put the keep up here. Another keep. So the wooden keep. Yes, and it's all about the core. So you're going to go up here. You're going to be you're going to be a little taller than average. And we're going to use this top because it's the only top I like. And we're going to put the flag on top. There we go. I, where's this, where are the steps going to go? Uh, actually, I'm going to pick you up and turn you this way because I want the steps to face this direction. There we go. And we'll do these steps, like so. And then where do I put the dummies? We need some dummies. Uh, let's put some barracks in. All right, and uh, this is the medium core. This is the extension. The large extension. I guess none of them are actually called barracks. No, this is called barracks. Yeah, I like the barracks. Let's put the barracks in. Let's raise it up to hide the windows. All right. And then on this side here, hmm, what's this little dude? That's the barracks again. What's this? No, that doesn't look right. Okay. And what is? Oh, these these things are kind of cool. Like this would go here. I mean, it doesn't work, but you could raise it up and down. You could raise it up and down, right? You can raise this up and down. So go like this. That looks pretty cool. We'll do that just because. And then on this side, uh, this extension, does it? It does. It'll fit there. We'll do that just because. There's no real roof to this, though, but we can put a chimney on the end. Other way, though. There we go, there's a chimney. 
And uh, I don't know, I guess that's standing room. Um, and then let's put some uh, dummies up here. And let's see here. Yes, I'm looking at which way the shadows go. Let's put the dummies this way, like one here. I'm thinking I'm going to have to take out some trees, but I'll use the decorative tree bit for this. And let's put another dummy here. I can try to put a dummy right over a tree and see if it takes it out. I don't think it will, but we can give it a try. That might take it out. You never know. Or it might just get built right next to that tree. And let's put another one here. Let's put another one here. Six should be enough? Or do I want to put two cores in? Well, I'm going to have to do more dummies for the other core anyway. So there is a training area. So we've got the training. We've got the door. We've got this. We've got everything going on. 221 planks, 32 textiles, which we're still short on, right? Yeah, 32 textiles, two tools, 81 stone. Uh, two people were passing by. One decided to join. Look, she's up here building the bridge already, or building the ladder. Start construction. We're going to go up to speed three now. And so this will get us our third keep core, second keep. And then for down here, right, one more. And no, don't even click on that. Don't even think about clicking on that. It's got to be a completely unique keep. So stone keep. Man. It's not a stone keep. That's why you can't find it. It's a wooden keep. And we'll do another core. So what's going to look right here? If I do this, I think something like this might look interesting. Run on the edge here. Run on the edge. I mean, it kind of blocks that other one, but it is going to be lower down. And the steps can't be there, though. They have to be... We have to pick this up. The steps have to be like so. And so I want to get it lined up kind of the same right and then down here close to the edge there we go and boy that doesn't look that that looks like a complete and utter failure what did i do that wasn't actually straight this is tough yes like this okay and then uh, put a top on. Actually, let's do the small top. Let's do the small top this time, just the plain top. Right? Okay. And then the steps go on this side. We're, we're going to do all the same steps. Yeah, that's not working very well, is it? That's not working very well either. Okay, we're going to actually put the steps on the other side where we can't actually see them. But it doesn't matter, because this is just to get more people in here. This is just a small keep part. I wish I had made this taller, but I didn't. And that's as short as that one goes. And so that is that. And that'll get us, uh, what, eight more soldiers, right? So let's start. Good. We've got all kind of building going on. And let's go ahead and speed it up. I was hitting the 1, 2, and 3 key, which is not how you speed up foundation. So no wonder it didn't get sped up. So there we go with the keeps. And then uh, how many unemployed do we have now? We have three more unemployed. Galutus, Thomason, and Ban... Ban Ban. <laughs> Ban Ban's my favorite name. Oh, look, yeah, we got the circular fields. Check them out. All right, uh, where's Ban Ban live? Let's uh, let's just use this as a guinea pig here, and say who do we got? We got everybody is uh, 200 or more away, so you're all over here then, oh, or you don't have a home. Uh, Ban Ban, where do you live? Yeah, you're over in here. Okay, this is a crowded area, I tell you. But we should get uh, people moving into the other side soon. And the fish is now still 853 because we can't really hold anymore. Is anybody overflowing with fish, though? Right, I was going to check this. This. Uh, bakery we know. Extensions we know. Uh, here's a market. Here's a food stall. Where is this food stall? This is the bread stall. We don't have bread yet, so we know. 
Here's another food stall. This is over here. Aha. But we need even more people living over here for this. So we have these three. Food, food, and food. And then we have this food stall, which is right over here near the bridge. And I think we have one more food stall right next to it. Okay, these two. So potentially, I could get somebody to cross the bridge and do this, right? So let's say this is going to be berries. And who lives close? The band band's only 104 away, so you're going to do this. And then, yeah, you're walking over here for, the, for that. And then this is going to be fish. And fish is going to be Gelotus. You're going to do the fish. You're going to come over. Cross the bridge, come over, sell some fish, then go back home across the bridge. All right. And these cool looking houses, did I actually tell those not to upgrade? I didn't. I think I'm going to now because I really like the way they look. That one I did. I'm unchecking this one. And I'm unchecking this one there. So we have varied... Yeah, these I, I think I unchecked already, yeah. Yeah, so we have uh, variable uh, types of housing upgrades, both high density and non-high density. As far as the treasury goes, we're now plus 12 again, and we're pushing against the top. I could build more treasury, but remember at the end of the last episode, I was actually worried about making a profit. I forgot to look. And once again, uh, we're, making, we're making the money. Uh, and we actually lost 210 last week. But that's probably because of trade, because with the full set of traders coming in, with selling of the 30 berries, 20 planks, 20 polished stones, 20 tools, and now 5 swords, that's a lot of trading. And, uh, you know, the next time somebody wants to come into the village, that'd be great. Okay, we have, uh, Bathine. Where do you live? You're still moving over here. You're killing me. All right, you don't upgrade. This will protect against that. You can't upgrade. You can't upgrade. This, this is density upgrades, not quality upgrades. You're already upgraded. You're already upgraded. Same one. You're already upgraded. Going through here. Oops, I already unchecked you. I already unchecked you. These, this conglomeration of homes is already upgraded. Okay, good grief. Right. And actually, it looks like you haven't upgraded either. And you can't. Okay. Alright, how are we doing? Let's promote all our serfs. And we'll leave everybody else alone. And there goes the horseman. He's rapidly coming over here to the Lord Manor. The puny little Lord Manor. And uh, let's see what he wants. Um... Deliver five bread. We still have 300 bread, so we'll do that, but what's the score? And that reminds me, I forgot to give those new um, soldiers weapons. The score is uh, clergy 24, labor 42, so you're going to help the clergy. You're going to assist the clergy. All right. And ta-da. All right, let's give our poor people weapons. Swords, swords, swords. Oh, we might have to actually give them spears. I'm gonna run out of swords. But no, I didn't. All swords. All of them have swords. Bunch of them are wounded. We have new villagers now. This is the first thing I want to do. Uh, let's go to general. Let's assign. I don't care where they live. Let's just get them in here. There they are. Uh, Hannah, Thomason, Wimerus, Wildebald, Quindless, Celia. I don't know which ones are new. You're all filled out now. All right, let's hit the this menu now. And yes, I don't have enough swords. So you're all spears. Maybe spears will help us win. Maybe spears are the secret to the winning. Who knows? But right, go get trained. Thank you. So how are we doing over here? Way up on that hill. You can see that our keep's starting to get done. You see ladders. How are the builders making it up here? That's the question. You can see that they've taken the long road at first. Will they be able to take the short road now that the ladders are finished? Yes. There, he's walking down this ladder. 
This ladder just finished, that's why. The great ladder just finished. Okay. Is this ladder finished? This one is finished, yes. So they all ought to be able to take the shortcut as the keep gets built. And I don't think any of the dummies took out any of the trees. Actually, they're not all built yet. Only two of them are. Okay. Two people, one decided. Why? 33 village... Oh, they're lacking religion. Alright, well, I'm going to have to update the religion. I could turn this into a church or I can build a church. I usually always tear down the original church. 17 of 95, though. There's plenty. There's plenty. Who's complaining and why? Is this one full? 29 to 71. I don't really get the religion complaint. Somebody has to walk too far. Why? Am I going to have to follow him around? This one is over here. We could put a little church up here. I don't... I, I don't really understand why they think they're lacking church or religion. Oh, that reminds me. Remember this failed inspection. Let's fix that. A decorative tree, please. Get rid of both of them. There we go. Bulldoze. Delete. Right, now those windmills are all ready to go. Good, I feel so much better. And they haven't started building the third piece yet, have they? They have not. Our builders are all busy. And we have two cloth. And how many wool? Zero wool. Alright, we need more sheep. Did I build a sheep farm over here and not assign anybody? No, Henry. I assigned Henry. He was the last one I assigned. Alright, we're going all wool then. Uh, let's open this back up again. And the sheep farm is right here. Lots of, lots of sheep. More sheep. One. How about just two? And then we see how that goes. There we go. All right, let's get that built. Uh, we have two unemployed. Uh, Bethine, where did you move in at? You're over here again. Hopefully that won't happen again. Yeah, because I need more people over here. Please. But uh, people aren't happy, so if you live over here, you want to get over here, it could be that this isn't quite central enough. I could use another little church maybe over here. Now, we have enough room for housing, right? We have plenty of room for housing. All right, I'm going to put a little church right over here. We know we're going to need one eventually anyway. So, let's do that. And let's put a regular old church. And we'll do the core here. And as usual, oh, there's a trader guy. I'll start out small, and then it won't be big enough, and I'll have to go bigger. There's a prediction that bad weather is coming. I recommend that we stock as much food as we can whilst the weather is good. Very well. Okay, so the fact that the bakeries are done has triggered the bad weather, even though we're not making bread. That's okay. I feel certain that we have enough food to survive any bad weather. Uh, we don't even have enough space to store the food, uh, which actually could be a problem. Uh, I'm buying stained glass, right? Yeah, because I already built a church. And... Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and slap, let's see, this is extension A, no. I'm gonna go ahead and slap two cores on this. Because it's a two-core church, right? So we're ready, so we don't immediately run out of space. And then I'm gonna put a round tower. I'm gonna put a round tower over here. Sure, that blocks one window, but not the other one, yep. And I'm gonna raise this up like so. And then I'm going to take one of these bells there we go. And let's put this back here. Right about there. That blocks that window. Alright, let's lower let's actually lower this tower down a little bit then, which is fine because you can still see over the top of the church. Right, and that's gonna hold 43 people and require 106 polished stone, 132 stone, 60 planks, 51 tools, 10 glass, no cloth. And we have plenty of everything. And it's going to be... This is over on the bread side. I think we need some blue over here. It's going to be a blue church. So get going on that. Okay. We could probably use more builders, honestly. 
but we'll see. Everything's kind of slowing down. Hey, it's oil be here. Where where you where'd you move in? Ooh, you're building a house right there. Is this an upgrade? It is an upgrade. And you can upgrade too. I don't mind that at all. You may upgrade even further with this. All right. Um, so we have wheat. We should have a load of wheat. Oh, the farms are going to be full. All right, it's time. It is time. Let's get going. Uh, oil be here. You go there. And... Uh, Eikusa. You go here as well. And you're going to be pulling the wheat out of the farms, which are probably full. Actually, they're not. I don't know what happened to the wheat. What happened to the wheat from last season? You only did eight? You got to be kidding me. I don't know what happened to the wheat. I don't know. I have no idea what happened to the wheat from last season, but it looks like we lost most of it. This is... This is stunning. This is a stunning... development. Maybe it just rotted. Maybe it goes away if you don't collect it fast enough. Anyway, there's the wheat. No, we turned it into flour. Oh! I forgot I put somebody up here. That's a, okay. I forgot I put Mori up here. And so you turned all that wheat into flour by probably going right to the farm and getting it. Well, there you go. And now we have... Okay, now we're moving the bread in here. Eight wheat, 42 flour. We need bakers. So, Cornelius, what a name for a baker. And... Promote all, thank you. And... Godif. There's our bakers, so we can produce some bread. The bad weather's coming. Everybody's either building or upgrading. They're upgrading. So, yeah, there's going to be a lot of upgrades. Uh, things are boiling up between the realm and our evil neighbors. Oh, the keeps aren't done yet. No, I'll run a short quest. So I'll just run a short quest where we are guaranteed to bring the troops back mostly alive. Okay? Mostly alive. That's all I promised. I'm going to turn off upgrade for you. I'm going to turn off upgrade for you because I want these cool looking houses right next to the riverside. Yeah. You turn it off. You turn it off. Everybody else can upgrade. You already have, haven't you? No, you turn it off. Okay, there. That's my story. Right, let's go to the war menu. And how we got? We got a bunch of people that are fully trained or partially trained. Here's the mission list. Let's go ahead and send them out by... Nobody's injured, so everybody goes. Click. Almost. Requesting an audience. Man, come on. Give me a break. I'm right in the middle of something. That's it. Let's send them out. Send them on their way. In the meantime, before they go, let's talk to our envoy here, which is apparently hard to hit without hitting the Lord Manor. We'll talk to our envoy here. And he wants 20 fish. And it's going to be the clergy again because I remember they're still pretty far behind. There's that. And the soldiers are all going to be going. And what's the what's the warning window? It is the stone cutter is full. Well, if we had the builders to actually build the this new church, we would be using up all the stone and it wouldn't be a problem. This is interesting. The field's not a circle anymore. It's it's I'm just going to leave it at that's interesting. Okay. Uh, we have any more over here? Unemployed. Lemna, let's make sure I know where you live. Lemna, where did you move? Yeah, you're all moving over here. This is good. So we have plenty more for farmers now. So let's assign three more. Uh, Lemna and Eloda. We don't need to stare at that. And you don't have a home, Alice. So uh, I can't uh, assign you a job yet. Maybe you'll move in in some of these upgrades. We've already painted this crop field, yes, yeah, so two people are going to have to farm there. And then perhaps I can assign one more here as soon as somebody gets a home. But so far nobody has. There is one who's living on the other side though. Three of four have decided to join. And where does... Is it Orlava? Nope. Baptiste? Nope. How about Bethine? That's right, it was Bethine. You live right over here, boy. 
Uh, I guess berries. All right, yeah, there you are. You're in for the berries. And really, we really have a warehouse issue, or I should say a granary issue, because this is full. This is completely full. I'm going to put in another granary. And you're going to be right. You're going to be facing the same way. We'll put you on this side, though. But you're going to be this the granary district. Let's hope it's going to pass fast. All right, our first rainstorm. Anyway, you're going to go right over here. And I'm actually going to high prioritize you so we get done. So we don't lose any of the fish. Because now we're really going to get a lot of fish. So you remember the rainstorms in Pinewood. This was the big deal. Because, you know, the food ran low. Well, we're sitting on 1,950 berries. We've got 972 fish. Only because, well, we can't collect them. We have 375 bread, and most of that was due to questing. So, uh, how's the map look in the rain? Yeah, it's our first rainstorm. It looks pretty serious. It's a pretty serious storm. You can hardly see anything. Let's uh, zip up on the hill here. How how is the keep construction going? It is uh, it is close. It is close. And I bet while I was not paying attention while we're way up here, the sheep farms finished. No. So, yeah, we definitely need more builders. And since you got... You guys, you know what? You're all builders. There we go. Three more builders. Might not make any difference, but... We know we need builders, so there you go. And so, uh, hopefully our soldiers, uh, who are now fighting out there in the rain somewhere, are doing okay. Ooh, do I dare look? Yeah, and so until the, the first stage quits, it's not telling us what they're doing. Uh, the mission list. They are they are at image one. So we'll see how that goes. Okay, they're back from the first step. Uh, keep my troops with you. The success probability is extreme. Let's see what we're looking at here. We've got three wounded, four wounded... All of the one... Well, you have a lot of experience. Don't know if we lost anybody yet. I feel like we probably have. Let's keep them with you. And, uh, yeah, you can hardly see the city for the storm. Uh, and we have uh, we've definitely have a builder shortage, so I'm just sort of waiting it out while everything that I asked to get built gets built. And, yeah, that includes the keep up on the hill. Look how dark and gloomy that looks. Well, that looks pretty scary, doesn't it? All right, our granary is almost done, but not quite. We're waiting on that last builder. In the meantime, you can see that uh, we still have 1,800 berries. We still have... Uh, we're now up to uh, 1,047 fish, because remember, the fish increases here. If you look at the uh, city stats, fish are increased by 20% for the next 48 days, while the berries, the wheat, and the grapes are decreased by 50%. So, uh, we're going to be doing a lot of fish sales. All right. Okay, now, it's teasing me, okay? It's teasing me. It's saying the success probability for this final stage of the quest is high. I have multiple saves before this point. I'm going to go ahead and send them out. And I know what's going to happen. They're going to be successful, and they're going to come back empty-handed because that's the luck of this town <laughs> well we'll see can you finish this come on there you go what you didn't finish it all right we're at that stage of the game where oh the the sheep farms are complete where the uh, builders can't actually finish a building all right we have sheep here did uh, anybody pick a house it doesn't look like it everybody's sitting in the center of the city i've noticed that we haven't got anybody new to move in so what? Oh, goodness. That's not what I wanted to look at. Let's look. I know you can hardly see, right? There's all kind of space for new housing here. I'm not sure what's going on. Not sure what's going on. There's a well right here. There's markets here. This is a beautiful place for residential area. Um, we, we can You can go all the way to the road over here. There's plenty of room. Uh, I am going to chop off, you know, slightly further away from the church. But there is plenty of room here. And actually, we don't need to put fish everywhere. 
So let's swoop down and swoop back here so you have more of a place to build. Okay, building complete granary. All right, let's head over to the granary. You might not be building because there's no builders yet. I don't know. But anyway, uh, here, we, here we go here. And I'm going to do one slot of berries and the rest are going to be fish. Just because we have so many fish. And do we have anybody close? No, everybody's 161. So, let's see if I can encourage... I said you not to upgrade. If I put you at a density upgrade, will you immediately try to upgrade or not? Oh, I know what's wrong. We need to get it to the end of the month. That's why all those people in there now are not serfs yet, and all the houses are full, so they're not upgrading. And so, I need somebody to upgrade. So, to force an upgrade, building complete wooden keep. Well, you know what? That's not the keep that's finished. Can you even see in the fog? There's a fog. Right here, all those people that are unemployed, we don't care where they live. Can you read what it says there? Your soldiers were defeated. They had a good chance. I got suckered into it. They were defeated. Promote all. You're going to get your homes. Fine, wooden keep. Get them all. All of them. By the way, I forgot to build dummies again. This is the second time I forgot to build dummies for a new keep. I built them over there, but not over here. We need... Uh, I need to edit and put uh, training dummies in. And you will be training down in this little corner here. This is a special training spot for you all. Uh, if we can get them built. I need to get the sheep farmers in. I'm telling you what, I was, uh, once again, once again, the luck of this city, I tell ya, I tell ya, but, uh, we'll see what happens, uh, do you need more than four, I'd like to put five in, I think, uh, we'll put another one right here, I wanna put the, yeah, that's right up here, there you go, you can train in the shade, it's a nice, it's a nice woodsy, it's a woodsy keep kind of thing going on there, start construction, and I'm going to high prioritize this, even though apparently you can, it, the dummies have to be done for you to train. But, uh, so the soldiers are coming back and they lost, so we didn't get any reward. I said I was going to stop them at the second bit, and I didn't. And that was foolish, and you're going in and out the wrong door, I just noticed that. Quest failed, thanks. Thank you. Yep, well, we're kind of used to it, aren't we? Yeah. And, uh, right. Uh, let's give, uh, my new people weapons. We, we do have swords now, but they don't have any place to train yet. Uh, we'll work on that. Boy. And then, uh, do we have anybody new? We don't. Nobody's been coming into the city, and it's pouring the rain. What a gloomy day. What a gloomy, gloomy day. And here comes the, uh, the envoy. Let's, uh, let's get ready to talk to this guy. Uh, you want berries. Berries is fine. We still have 1,800 of them. Nobody's lacking food. We're not even getting close here with the rain because, just because it's just absolutely ridiculous how much food we have. Mm, and we're currently, the score is currently 44 to 42. Labor has fallen behind, so I shall assist the people and give us a little bit of money. What a sucker. What a sucker for going after that last, that last quest stage, I tell ya. What a sucker. And uh, two and two are coming in, so, we, so we've got another immigration wave, that's good. Uh, we are actually creating bread now. I don't know how much. We haven't sold any beer because there's no place to sell it. Uh, I haven't built a tavern yet. I'm not going to build a tavern until we have a solid supply of beer. And I did the wheat. So it's really time to start up with the beer. Oh good, we now have houses. Because I've made them all serfs, we now have houses over here. So this is good. We've got a lot of people that are moving in over here. And then as far as over here is concerned, I never assigned anybody new here. And do we have anybody close? We don't have any available villagers that live close. So you know what? I am going to just steal somebody without hitting the unemployed button. Uh, Bethine, I want you in here. 
and let's see. I don't want to take a market tender, but and I don't. Let's take another forager, Placencia. You're in here. Two people for this. We could probably use more. Are there any other foragers? Let's take Barbata. Another forager. There are three. That's pretty good. You ought to be able to start filling this thing out. 1,113 fish, 1,752 berries. And what a revolting development. All right. You... Oh, good. So you're working on that. You guys have the dummies. Good. We can assign a few more people here. That's good. How many were we missing from this one? I don't know that that many... That, that many croaked. We did lose some. But that's the way it goes. Our keep complex here is looking pretty good. How close are these to done? Yeah, we have all the wood. We just need five more cloth and we're done. Good. Uh, there you go. So for uh, this episode, uh, same result. But but we're close. We've got the... Uh, you can see the keep building and the fog up on the hill. Uh, we're still making a profit somehow. Happiness is 92, so four people are joining out of four. So everything is working correctly except that pesky keep quest. And let's... Uh, Let's pull back a little bit. I think this looks really neat in the rain. Uh, if we put down, if we sit down here, we see this uh, church here in the foreground with the gargoyle looking out, and we see the spooky dark clouds up over the hill. And uh, yeah, it's something to slow it down to a regular speed there. There we go. So once again, uh, no good result from the keep quest, but we are closer. We're closer. We're doing a lot of building. And uh, next time out, and expect a Wednesday episode, there will be uh, another Keep Quest run. And keep your fingers crossed that uh, we, we get something out of it. <laughs> yeah, keep your fingers crossed. All right. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. We'll see you later.